Hi my loves, it's Lizny and welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna be doing a Pretty Little Thing haul and I'm extremely excited about it because I love Pretty Little Thing. And if you guys keep up with me on my socials, you might have noticed that I won a Pretty Little Thing giveaway given by one of my favorite YouTubers, Angui. I'm gonna link her YouTube channel in the description box below so you guys could check her out. She posts a lot of good lifestyle and haul videos. So yeah, let's get into it. Curious butterflies. You mean bread butterflies? Yes, of course. It. Hmm? So the first item that I'll be showing you guys is this gray top. I really like the way this top fit a lot. I love the neckline. This neckline is like really popular right now. A lot of people have been buying um shirts with this same neckline and the sleeves they were sitting at a good place on my shoulders. The one thing that I did notice now is that one sleeve was sewn and the other sleeve wasn't i guess that this is like a factory error or something so i usually would return stuff like this but because i know how to sew i'm just gonna try to fix the hem of the sleeve to match this brown one to match this one i also wanted to add that the fabric is very stretchy and soft it's not like a cotton the fabric is very comfortable pretty little thing calls this fabric jersey the name of the shirt is charcoal jersey v short sleeve t-shirt and i got in a uk size 8 which i believe is a us 4 i'm gonna be leaving the sizes down below i feel like this is good for the warmer season because of the way it feels and the thickness of it it's not too thick but i feel like it's just the perfect breathable fabric for winter so that you're not sweating but you're not freezing this next shirt is one of my favorite things of the entire haul because of how um, vibrant that it was I really did not think that the print of the shirt was going to be this vibrant at all like it came out way more blue than I expected but I like it a lot and I like the shade of gray this second item is called the gray Snoop Dogg faces oversized t-shirt and I got that in a size small it is way longer than I expected too. I could have sized down, but with the baggy fit, it looks really cute if you just like tuck it up on the sides and just fix the way that it's sitting on your body. So yeah, I really liked it. it was, it's just a regular baggy graphic tee, which I feel like is really good to pair with literally anything in the winter. You can pair it with sweatpants, you could pair it with jeans, you could pair it with anything that you feel like complements your style, any basic bottom would go with it. So this I definitely recommend, it's really comfortable. And I don't know, I just love it. I love the way it looks, I love the color, I love everything. This one is very soft, it's a little bit thin, but it's not too thin, like it's a breathable thin. I don't. I think if it would have been any thicker, it would make you too hot. The following item is the Petite Domenica. I don't know how to pronounce that, I'm sorry if I butchered it. Black basic v-neck bodysuit. I don't remember what's the fabric that they call this on Pretty Little Thing, but this bodysuit is thin. It's thin, but a breathable thin. The only thing is, is that it's sheer. You have to make sure that you wear it with a nude or skin colored bra or undergarment. Or I mean, if you don't wanna wear anything under, you don't have to, but just know that it's see-through and people will be seeing what's under the top. But I really love it. I love the way it fits. It's really comfortable, breathable. It's good for those winter nights where you go out, like to a restaurant or any outing, you start getting hot, temperature starts rising. And I just feel like this is a good top for that, for occasions where you go out because it's very breathable. You could also dress it down and it could be for a casual event or location that you're attending because yeah it's just it's a basic black bodysuit so you literally can dress it up or dress it down i feel like this is a closet basic which is why i wanted to get one i have a white one from pretty little thing i wanted to get this black one and i love pretty little things bodysuits for literally any occasion like i said you could dress them up dress them down whenever i go out i have a pretty little thing bodysuit ready on standby to go they never fail so make sure you guys get one because i promise you you won't regret it i love the way everything from this haul fits like it literally fits so good this one's called the gray marl basic strappy plunge jumpsuit i could have sized up i didn't size up because i thought it was going to be way more stretchy like it is stretchy but it's not 
not like super like that jersey knit stretch that jersey fabric from the black bodysuit that i showed you guys that stretch is way more elastic than this one this one is a little bit more tighter so if you guys get this type of fabric it's more of like a cottony fabric make sure to get the right size it fits me but because it fits me a little tight it's a little sheer in the bum area i love the front i love the way that the neckline is cut it literally is just so flattering and at first i was a little skeptical on buying this because the line down the middle how it's split it's barely noticeable once you wear it and i just i love the way it fits it's long because you know i'm 5'1 at the bottom in the ankle area it scrunches up because i'm not tall enough but for me it's good enough one thing that i do want to point out about this bodysuit is that it's not a lot of protection in this area so there is spillage that can happen you have to be careful that you don't get a nip slip when you bend down like you just have to be very careful with this area because it's not a lot of there's not any construction to help cover that area. The next item that I got is the ultimate crop sweater in a size small. So it's basically, it's just a black crop sweater. It has a raw cut. It has a raw cut. So because of the fact that I got in a size small, I didn't want to get in an extra small because I felt like it was going to be too short. To me, that was a good decision because when I lift up, it does not show any of the bust area nothing shows if you wear a bra or bralette under it won't show the inside you guys can see is lined with fleece it's not like a super thick fleece but i think it's good enough for a winter you know in the winter you layer so i'm glad that it's not too thin but it is on the thinner side that's something that i wanted to know but it's definitely warm enough for you to be warm in the winter if you wear something under it something on top it fit a little tighter than expected both in the arm and the bust area but i do like the way that it fit and i'm happy with the product the next item that i have is the blue wash sweatshirt in a size small so this sweater the color isn't exactly what i expected from the website but i do love the way that this sweater fits it's just a crew neck sweater one thing that's different from the website is that as you can see it's like a little distress not like distress with rips but just like all those cotton balls I guess that was the style that they were going for. I don't mind it at all. I just I feel like, in my opinion, it makes the sweater look older. But it's whatever. It's not that big of a deal to me. The sweater is also longer than I expected. This is literally long enough to be like a sweater dress. I love the fact that it is also lined with a fleece inside so that you're warm. I don't think that these sweaters are like, oh my god, the warmest sweaters ever. But they're enough to keep you warm. Like trying them on i was starting to sweat also i liked how the waistband was the perfect size so because i don't like to wear my sweaters long i like to scrunch them up to give it that baggy effect that loose baggy effect the waistband was literally on my waist and the sweater just folded over and it felt so comfortable and nice it didn't feel like oh my god like i have to keep on picking it up no like it was literally perfect so i like the length of the waistband that they give to the sweater because it gives you the ability to put the sweater up and have the rest falling in a nice way without you feeling uncomfortable and that it's not falling the right way on your body this item is whoa why is there so much like flying things in the air from the clothes oh my god so this next item is definitely my favorite from the sweaters this one is the sand ultimate oversized hoodie and i got it in a size small this is just a basic hoodie it doesn't have any embroidery or graphics or anything on it it's just an oversized nude light nude color beige cream however you like to call it hoodie i loved the size of the hoodie i loved how big it was because it gives you the ability to literally put the hoodie over your head i don't know if you guys can relate but if i have like my curly hair like i did in the try on portion 
you literally in some hoodies cannot put the hoodie over your hair and it's like literally so annoying like what was the point like it's up to here attacking you not letting you breathe and then it's not even covering your whole head so when there are big hoodies like this attached to a sweater i really appreciate it because it literally allows me to put my hoodie on use it no matter what type of hairstyle i have so i really appreciate that this hoodie is also long it's longer than i expected it could also fit as a t-shirt hoodie if that's your style the length of the waistband is small enough to give you the ability to put it on your waist or your stomach area and having the rest fall to give it that baggy effect this color is also a staple in my opinion for the fall season because nudes are very popular and you could wear it with literally anything and it will look so cute so yeah so the next two pieces that i'm showing you guys came together these are two petite joggers they're called the petite stone and white basic cuffed hem joggers they were a two pack and so this is just the white one because it's petite it fits perfect on my waist and perfect on the length the only thing that I did not like about it was that there was no drawstring and no pockets and that it was little too tight. I should have like caught on to if it's petite, it's going to be smaller overall. I just wanted to buy petite because of my height and because I have a small torso and usually petite bottoms fit me better than regular bottoms. But next time if I order petite size, I will definitely size up. So yeah, it is a bit too tight for my liking for the vision that I had to wear these white sweatpants, but it's fine. I literally own other sweatpants that fit me the same, but I could work with these. It's literally fine. I'm not going to return them. I love the way they fit and I'm going to work with them and I'll show you guys how they look. It was pretty much the same for the these stone joggers. They're more of like a, a nude than a stone in my opinion but yeah the only thing is that the stitching is also like coming off here i'm gonna try to fix it because you know i know how to sew but i don't know this has never happened to me with pretty little thing i have these other gray baggy joggers from pretty little thing they're more of like a soft cottony like when you think of sweatpants you think of that fabric i don't know how to explain that. i don't know what the fabric is i expected the fabric of these two sweatpants to literally be the same as that one because of the way they looked on the website. So I suggest when you guys want to buy things that are similar on the website to look at the fabric that was used to make the garment so that you can not make the same But it's fine because it wasn't really a mistake for me because I love the items. The final product. And I think this one might be my favorite one. You guys can hold me accountable. This is the petite light wash splim hem jeans so these jeans let me give you all a little story time a little backstory these jeans i previously bought them but not from the petite section and they literally fit me perfect but they were so long they were so long that the split part was after my foot it started to split after the end of my foot like after my toes I love the way that these jeans fit because they are a petite size. It fits me really good in the waist. I have not found jeans in years that fit me that good on the waist. Like it's usually perfect on the bum area and then baggy on the waist. But these jeans, I'm in love with the way that they fit. They fit perfect on the bum, on the thighs. And I love the part in which it starts splitting on my foot. I feel like it's a perfect size. It literally would look amazing with heels. I'm not sure about the sneakers. I think it might be touching the floor, the hem of the jeans, but I'll try them on anyways to see how it fits with the sneakers. I'll just, I'll give it a try and I'll let you guys know, but it definitely will look amazing in heels. So yeah, I've had my eye on these jeans for a really long time. This is how the pocket, the back pocket looks like because a lot of people have been buying these jeans and I wanted a pair for so long. And I finally got my hands on it. They always sell out on Pretty Little Thing. Hopefully when I put the link down below, it's not sold out. I really love this pair of jeans. The only thing is that the button is a little loose. Like, look, 
I don't know if it was just me. Like, maybe it was just my order that Pretty Little Thing is playing with. Like, I'm gonna try to put something on it to, like, put it better. But, yeah. Pretty Little Thing has been playing with me this whole haul. Like, come on, guys. Get it together. But, yeah, guys. This is it. I hope you guys enjoyed the haul and loved it. Please let me know down below what other stores you guys would like to see me do a shopping haul from. And, yeah. Let me know what your favorite items were as well. Make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on that post notification bell so that you're notified whenever I post a new video. And make sure that you guys follow me on my socials so that you're able to keep up with me. That's it for today. Bye. Oh, 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 oh.